Hello, in this clip we're going to make some disappearing rabbits. They can hide in the grass and they can peep out at you. They can disappear completely and peep out again when you're ready. For this clip you will need some pens, some scissors, a pencil, maybe a ruler and some different colours of card. So what we need is a piece of blue card or red card, any colour you like to choose. Long and narrow and fold the two long edges together. So it's folded in half, long way round. And then we turn it with the fold towards us and get the scissors ready. Now this is where we've got to think how wide our fingers are. So we want to clip a chop every time on the finger space. If you find that a little bit difficult to see, you can put your finger there and do a little mark with the pencil. Mark with the pencil every time there's a finger. Mark along the card from the fold edge and then you can cut up, I call these chop and stops. You start to chop and then you stop. You start to chop and then you stop. Don't cut right through. If you do that, the whole thing falls to pieces. Chop and stop, chop and stop, chop and stop. Now open it wide and you've got this kind of a shape. Some people make those into Chinese lanterns, which are rather fun, but we're not doing that today. Now then, you need another piece of card of a different colour. Again, it's got long sides and short sides, and I'm going to weave with this card into the slots. So first it goes down, and then it goes up, down, up, and down until we get to the end. And that should slide backwards and forwards easily through the slots. I'm going to turn this one over, and I'm going to draw on the white bits that are showing. So this is where I need the pen. So. A rabbit, I'm just doing a circle, a head, two big ears, and a little face. Here's a rabbit. That's another one. Two big ears and a little face. Now these rabbits are sitting in the woods. They're looking out to see where the nice long juicy grass is. <laughs> if they can see some, they might hop off to get it. Right, you can add on whatever details you want. If you want them to have legs, that's fine. But I haven't got time to do legs today. Now in between, the rabbits, the grass has grown nice and long, so you can do some lots of spiky grass in the middle of the field. That's what the rabbits are looking for. And a little row of grass along the bottom. I'm just doing it very quickly. If you do it, you might do it better than me. Now then, here's the rabbits, there's the grass. Oh, boo rabbits, somebody's coming, hide. They've gone, completely gone. Here they are, hello, they're hiding. Go and hide rabbits, somebody's coming. Oh, there they go. So here's a few more ideas that you can use. Instead of rabbits, you could have a snake. Here's a snake in the grass this time, but we don't want the snake to get near us. He creeps away and he goes hiss as he goes away. Watch out chickens, here comes the fox and there he is. The chickens have disappeared and the big red fox has come to chase them. So you can think of your own ideas when you have made your slider. You can make it into all sorts of different things. I hope you have some good ideas. I'm sure you will.